I know what you're thinking. Bicycles downtown? Earl, you must be in Budapest or Thailand or some foreign place. No, the simple truth is this could be your town. It could be any town USA. Because experts tell us in the very near future, the automobile as we know it will be an extinct species in major cities across America. That's why tonight, One in the Town takes an exciting look at what the future has in store for urban transit. It's One on the Town. With Earl Camembert. Urban transit of the future. Electric carts, overhead railways, moving sidewalks. These are just a few of the things we'll be using to get from place to place. And why the change? Well, let's start with the obvious. The scarcity of gas and oil in the world, not to mention the expense. And how about the environment? Toxic gases and poisons polluting our major cities. In short, urban transit will be relying on a much more efficient inexpensive and healthier mode of transportation like walking or taking the subway as our cities grow in size and population we'll be depending on the subway system more and more but experts tell us that the subway system is very 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 complex But aside from subways, what about the human factor? The modernization of urban transit could put a lot of people out of work. People like the parking lot attendant. An absence of cars means an absence of parking lots. And an absence of parking lots means no work for guys like Dwayne here. Dwayne, I'm wondering if you could tell me how you see this transition to a future mode you, of... <laughs> Well, we get a chance to see the parking lot attendant in action here. <laughs> Dwayne? <clears throat> Dwayne? Thank you for Dwayne, uh, I was about to ask uh, how you see this future uh, transition uh, to Just a more... Just <laughs> And what about the commuter? The guy who takes his leisurely drive in from the suburbs to his office downtown. What might his reaction be when that leisurely ride turns into a somewhat harried and crowded ride on a monorail, perhaps? Let's find out. Excuse me. On the positive side of the ledger, I guess you can say it gives the cop on the beat more time to spend with the people and less time writing out traffic tickets. Now, what effect will this have on crime in our major urban centers? Do you have a permit? This... <clears throat> Sorry? Do you have a permit? Um, officer, I'm Earl Cannon Bear, one in the town. Do you have a permit? I'm... Well, we've never acquired a permit before, I don't think. Do uh, you have I'm... a permit? No, I don't. No. Okay, do you want to move along, please? You're blocking the sidewalk. We can, we're just... Uh, move. We have one more move. shot. Of... Please move. Thank this you. is our last shot up. Fine, so that's the... okay. You need I a permit. It'll only please. take a few minutes. Come on, everybody, let's go. Move it. I... Come on, get that is ladder. It money? Is everybody. It... No, it's not get... money. I've heard that. No, I, I heard that. That's... You're going to okay. have to move no, it. No, I didn't say anything. Come on, let's go. Everybody. Quickly now, let's go. Move it, everybody. Come on. Come on, move. Let's go. 